John Cena indeed is going to main event WrestleMania after winning the Royal Rumble match and choose whether he wants to battle for the WWE or world title. At WrestleMania 29, I challenge the WWE Champion. The former WWE Champion. Yeah, sure, The Rock beat me fair and square. And he beat you fair and square at WrestleMania last year. But when you're talking about wins and losses, you have never beat me. Besides, The Rock versus John Cena is deja vu. I've already seen that television show. It's a rerun. The Rock beats John Cena because you can't get it done. You can't win the big one, John. You beat me in a match, and I will give you my WrestleMania title shot. You just made the stupidest decision of your life. I will beat you, and at WrestleMania, I will beat The Rock, and all of you will know that the champ is here! Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is scheduled for one fall, and the winner faces The Rock for the WWE Championship at WrestleMania. It's a big fight feel here in Dallas tonight. And it's all about going to WrestleMania to face The Rock for the WWE Championship in the main event. It doesn't get any bigger than that, King. From Chicago, Illinois, weighing 218 pounds, C. And Punk. Earlier tonight, this fan CM Punk said that tonight isn't about the WWE champion, The Rock. He said tonight is not about the people. He said tonight is more important than any one thing because tonight it's about him. Yeah, you're right. This one's for all the marbles. Can you imagine what's going through the mind of CM Punk, knowing how big this match is? From West Newberry, Massachusetts. I feel Weight lucky. 251 pounds. I feel strong. See! Time to go to work. So much is at stake here, ladies and gentlemen. The winner of this match will go on to WrestleMania on April 7th off Broadway to take on the WWE Champion The Rock in the main event. Oh man, look at this. 17,131 WWE fans on their feet right here in Dallas, Texas tonight for John Cena and CM Punk. John Cena won the opportunity to face The Rock at WrestleMania when he won the Royal Rumble back in January. But Cena gave all that up to prove once and for all that he could beat CM Punk here tonight. You're right. In his own words, Cena said he wanted to prove he was worthy. But I don't know if that was a wise decision. We'll find out in this match.
which has brought on enormous pressure on John Cena. Not only did Cena give up the opportunity to go to WrestleMania and have this match tonight and have to earn it once again, but as CM Punk pointed out, John Cena has not been able to beat Punk in a big match, and that's a fact. Only five other men in the nearly 50-year history of the WWE Championship have held the title longer than CM Punk, who held the gold in the neighborhood of 400 days. And he still thinks he should be carrying the gold, despite losing to The Rock at the Royal Rumble and Elimination Chamber. King, the five men who have held the WWE Championship longer than CM Punk, Bruno San Martino, Bob Backlund, Hulk Hogan, and Pedro Morales. Wow, that's some pretty impressive company for CM Punk. He didn't need a GPS to find the mark. Oh man, that knee looked painful. He gets out of trouble there. That'll leave a mark. Oh my gosh! Oh, the punch connects. John Cena has everything to lose here tonight, while CM Punk has everything to gain. And that's why so many people have questioned John Cena's decision to take this match. I think John Cena's ready to end this. Let's see. You can't see me. Oh, look at John Cena here. He's ready for the five-knuckle shuffle. And Punk's in trouble. John Cena has Punk in trouble. AA time. Cena going for the AA on CM Punk. Oh, wait a minute. Punk fights out of it. He's got Cena up for the GTS. Wait a minute, reversal. And it looks like, ooh, a power bomb. Oh, man. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Oh, wow. He was one step ahead on that one. Oh, out of nowhere. Great moves, great offense by John Cena. And the knuckles connect. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? He's putting those educated feet to good use. You know, King, sometimes in this business we have a tendency to overhype some matches, but there's no way you can overhype what's happening here tonight. Oh, you're right, Cole. The winner of this match is going to main event WrestleMania. Oh, you do not get up from that. He's measuring. That's it. He's out. And will this be it? One, two. Well, we're finding out right now why this has been one of the greatest rivalries in the WWE over the past year and a half. It all started back in 2011 at the Money in the Bank pay-per-view. Since that time, CM Punk seems to have had John Cena's number in big matches. Oh, but that all might change here tonight, Cole. Look at this. Cena may now be moments away from victory. Uh-oh, look at this. Oh, oh look at the STF. The STF locked in. I think Punk is going to have to tap. It's all about going to WrestleMania. It's all about going to WrestleMania. Oh, look at Punk. He's scratching, clawing, pulling himself towards those ropes. He's there, and it's going to force the break so close for John Cena. My gosh, what is it going to take? These two men have hit each other with their best shots. The AA, the go to sleep, but somehow each one of these superstars survived. Cena just looked over here at me and made a motion like, what's it going to take? Oh. oh, and pop right to the midsection. And now Cena pump what? No, no! Oh. Pile driver to Cena! Oh my god! Puck's going to WrestleMania! Puck's going to WrestleMania! That's it. You're right. Punk has done it. Here's the cover on Cena. 
Cena kicked out. What? Somehow, John Cena kicked out. I cannot believe it. I personally beat thousands of opponents with a pile driver. People just don't get up from a pile driver. And Punk again into the cover on Cena. Look at the put him away to get a kick out. This is unbelievable. And again a kick out by Cena. John Cena will not be denied. This is absolutely incredible. Both of these men have to be spent. I know Cole, I'm spent just, uh, just watching it. Me too, this is awesome. set his sights on the imposing, undefeated streak of The Undertaker, ultimately succumbing to the dead man at WrestleMania. Can you say 21 and 0? Oh, the streak lived on. Cena, meanwhile, would go on to face The Rock in their highly anticipated rematch from the prior year's WrestleMania. Only this time, the champ would emerge victorious. Cena does it! That's what it's all about. The WWE Championship. In the end, both John Cena and CM Punk had pushed each other's careers to higher plateaus. Their mark on one another undeniable. Two opposites of a spectrum forced to adapt and evolve in their quest for triumph. The ripples of their explosive conflict, transforming not only themselves, but forever changing the landscape of WWE. A rivalry that defined an era. One which will be long remembered as a true showcase of champions in WWE history.